wine. It is one of the oldest alcoholic beverages in the world, and attendees of Bogota's 10th annual wine expo are exploring the vast industry it has become. What you should be looking for is for the wine not to overpower the food and have the food's taste not overpower the wine. But the pairing is really up to your personal choice. The inquisitive wine tasters are receiving advice from Paola Borgo, the chief winemaker of Argentinian wine label Septima. What they may not know is how rare it is to see a woman holding this job. The wine industry traditionally has been dominated by men. There are few world statistics on the gender gap, but one University of California study found that less than 10 percent of chief winemakers in the U.S. are women. So it's no surprise that at the Bogota Wine Expo's wine competition, the judges panel is primarily made up of men. It still has a machismo culture. In fact, the few women that do make it to the top sometimes have to show a strong personality to compete. But this didn't intimidate Borgo. She knew she wanted to work with wine from the time she was young, watching her father, an agricultural engineer working in Argentina's wine country known as Mendoza. I loved my father's legacy, the art of making wine and the emotions that come from wine. Because you share it with people, you see their faces and the moment they are living in while drinking the wine. But wine goes through a long and complex process before it reaches the tables at restaurants and social gatherings. The cultivation of grapes requires knowledge in horticulture. The fermenting process involves chemistry. The heavy time demand of winemaking, like 16-hour workdays at the height of the season, has been blamed for discouraging women from this career. But Borgo says she manages with the support of her husband and children, and that constant challenge is what she loves most about her job. The climate conditions, those change every year, and the location of the vineyard makes a difference in the grapes. And you need to constantly work on how to form the specific taste of your wine. Harvesting the knowledge for winemaking takes years of study and experience. And women like Paula Borgo are showing the world that they can pop the cork off this male-dominated industry. Michelle Begues, CCTV, Colombia.